Hello there. If you found this video, then you are probably trying to do some tabletop simulator scripting with Adam. You may have gotten as far as installing it and then went to get the package for TTS and you are now hit with a certificate error. Uh, if you don't want to watch the whole video, the answer that you're looking for is download Pulsar. There's going to be a link in the video description where to get it. Uh, the steps are exactly the same as setting up Atom, but I'm going to go through a little bit more in depth. So if you want a bit of a walkthrough, uh, stick around. So used to be you'd go to Atom.io and you would download Atom, but now when you go here, you're going to get redirected to this GitHub blog and they tell you that Atom is being sunset. Uh, what does that mean? That basically it's not going to be supported. Uh, no more updates. The teletype, which was cool, you could code with a buddy, but really here's the part that you care about. A package manager won't work, so when you search for anything, you're going to get hit with a certificate error. So here's Adam that I have installed. Um, settings. I already do have the TTS plugin, so this mine will still work, but I'm trying to help uh, new new people. So if you type anything in here, uh, it's you're going to get this certificate error. It won't search. It won't search for tabletop. It won't search for anything. And you know, I already, like I said, I have it installed, but that doesn't help you. So Adam is no more. So like any normal person, you should have gone to Google. Adam cert expired. And now look, let's check these GitHubs, or these are Stack Overflows, rather. Um, dude's complaining that it's expired, and this guy says, oh look, use Pulsar. And this is what we want to use. I'll put the link, this link will be in the description, but you're going to want to go here, download Pulsar. Uh, they've got a rolling release and regular release. Um, rolling release is going to be new features as soon as they're available. Uh, regular release is going to be a bit more stable. Um, I'm going to go with the regular. If you want to be absolutely up to date as soon as it's possible, go with the rolling. But, uh, you know, they go somewhere in here, they say they try to make sure it, it, it's not going to break anything, but you never know. So I'm just going to go regular to save myself the headache. So I'm on Windows. We'll download the setup. And Windows is going to get pissed about this because... Um, it's uh, self-signed, but we're going to keep it. Yeah, I want to keep it. Come on. I guess we, oh, here we go. Okay, so open. And Windows is still mad. We're going to hit more info, run it anyway. And the setup can take a little while. Let's see if it's speedy today. Um, we're going to go all users. Doesn't really matter. Yep. Minimize this. I've got Windows updates to do. I'll probably fast forward through this piece. It seems to be a bit slow. Is it running? Everybody, yes, yes, okay, now it's working, install, this is a very exciting progress bar, contain yourselves.
There it goes. Okay. So that took, um, I don't know, less than five minutes, I think, but it does just hang. So uh, we're going to finish and run Pulsar. Maybe. Okay, cool. So it's, I mean, it's Adam. It, it looks totally the same. Um, you're going to go package, or package manager. So packages, open package manager. I need to expand this out. And we want to install, minimize that. Uh, oh, over here, sorry. Install tabletop. And that's what we want. Hit go, hit install, I guess, not go. This shouldn't take as long as the install did. Okay, it's done. So I don't need the settings anymore. I don't need that. All right, there's gonna be a bit of a cut right here. Um, my demo footage was bad, so I'm just going to restart that. Uh, so we're to the point, though, where we've got um, Pulsar ready to go. So I just, I'll make um, a lobby. I'll throw in a dice. Here we go. Um, okay, so I had tabletop running, got this, we will get the scripts, you can do control shift L, it's going to pull the stuff in, and there's nothing because this is just an empty table, um, if we right click on this dice and we edit, it's going to open the XML in the TTS Lua file for us, um, and then if we just paste in some code, Rip Adam, you were the best boy. Uh, just on this dice's onload function. And then we save. And then we, uh, I think it's Control Shift S. Save and play. Uh, yeah. There you go. So onload, that dice is now going to say that. Uh, and if you were familiar with Adam, this is very, very similar. If you're new to it, about basically any Atom-esque tutorials are going to still be relevant. It's just replace the word Atom with Pulsar now. Um, if you have any questions, you can leave them down below. I can try to help you out. I'm still new to this, even though I've been doing it for a while. Um, I, uh, I pick it up and put it down. I'll get distracted by something else in life. You know, shiny red ball. Gotta look over there. But... Hopefully this helps some of you. Um, I appreciate you uh, sticking around and watching till the end.